thanks for joining me today for Origami with Miss Cynthia. Today, I will show you how to create an Origami Panda Bear. Now, stick around so I can share with you our summer reading secret code. Now, let's get started. The supplies you will need are one eight and a half by 11 sheets of paper, a pair of scissors, coloring supplies, and glue. All right, guys, once you selected your sheet of paper you're wanting to work with, we're going to bring one of the corners downward, and we're, we want to create a square out of this sheet of paper, and we're going to cut off this um, rectangle side piece there, okay? Now just make sure that your triangle is facing downward so the openings are towards the bottom, towards you. And now what we're going to do is bring the right over to the left and go ahead and fold that right in half, just like this, okay? Go ahead and open it back up. Now we're going to work on our panda bear's um, face and the ears at the same time. So what we're going to do is go ahead and bring in the right side and we're going to bring it inward in a diagonal direction and then that corner just bring it back over like this and then crease right there. All right, this tip right here, go ahead and fold it back so the tip will align to the edge of your piece of paper like this. We're gonna do the same exact thing to the opposite side. So we're gonna grab this side, bring it in in a diagonal direction, and we're gonna scoop it back over to the left, and we're going to crease down, just like this. And then our little tip here, go ahead and just bring it back in and really the corner here, it's landing right at the edge of my paper on the back side there. Okay. So we're just going to align that to the edge. Let me fix that one. We're going to align that to the edge there. So it looks like this. All right. This top portion here, go ahead and bring it downward and we're going to fold it down into a rectangle shape and go ahead and crease right there. All right, go ahead and flip it over just like so. Now this sheet right here, the very top one, we're going to bring it towards the middle and crease, open it back up that bottom, the tip of that triangle, that bottom piece, go ahead and bring it up into that crease that we just created and crease there on the bottom and then just flip it all the way over so it looks like this. All right, let's go ahead and flip our piece over one more time. And then this bottom point here, we're just going to bring this corner, you'll see the crease that you did on the opposite side, you're just gonna align it to that and crease on the bottom. All right, go ahead and flip it over. And now it is time to add some color. Let me put this on the bottom so I'm not drawing on my table. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and draw my panda eye. So panda bears have a small small eyes, but what they do have is um, like a patch around their eye. Okay, so I'm doing my eye. I'm gonna go ahead and just circle that in. And then after that, I'm just going to create a patch around its eye, just like this, all right? And then I'm um, gonna bring in a thicker marker. Here in this spot right here, we're going to uh, 
create his nails. You can do whatever shape you'd like. I'm gonna do something that looks almost, just almost like a um, triangle there. Some dots there. All right, and then what I'm gonna color in around his eye is the patch. That is what really distinguishes the the panda bear. They're so adorable. All right, so you'll just color that whole piece in. And then you'll do the same thing to the to the other eye. Let me go ahead and color in his finish up his eye here. Okay, so the behind the ears, what I did is just go ahead and got behind there and just colored his, oops, colored his ear. Now you can use markers, whatever coloring supplies you have. All right, now once you're done um, coloring your panda bear, we're gonna bring out our glue and all the creases that we created, you're just gonna go through them and just glue them all into place. So I'm gonna flip it over and all of our little foldings here, just add a dab of glue and we're just going to glue everything into place here. All right, let me bring one that we have, I had finished. All right, and there you go, guys. There is your origami panda bear. And now for our summer reading secret code. It is O Watch 2. It can be entered at www.maricopacountyreads.org and redeem for additional points. Now, don't forget to send in a picture of your masterpiece to library at buckeyeaz.gov for an additional 15 points. Or you can bring in your masterpiece to either library location, the downtown library, Coyote Branch, or the bookmobile for an extra 25 points. It is that easy. If you haven't signed up for the summer reading program, it is not too late. I hope you have enjoyed this video and see you next week for more origami fun. Bye.